Hello guys, Danny here, and uh, today we're going to be doing um, a side quest, Fond Memories of You. Um, this is a quest that we need to do on floor 11, and um, ideally we uh, need to be roughly around this area here. So um, without further ado, let's get to it, but before we do that, there was actually something I forgot to do last time. Um, what is this new staff? Ooh, that has to be better than some of the stuff we're using now, right? Y yeah, that's considerably better than what we're using right now. Uh, yeah, you're both using downstairs, so. Now these guys are back line fighters, they don't necessarily need like super crazy items. Um But like the amount of tech that this stuff gives it, and it actually does give them a significant boost in attack, so like it is worth purchasing that I feel. Um You know no, you know the big guys can't have all the all the nice items, right? So um All right, so let's go to the forest entrance and go to floor 11. Uh this might actually be a pretty quick episode cuz um What I'm looking to do here is basically do this quest. So, first of all, um I don't want to fight a whole bunch of people here. Actually, we are quite close to leveling, so I might just grind a little bit to get a level while also doing this. Um, I don't want to have to fight the... Um, I don't particularly want to fight the, uh, the ants to level because they're kind of tough. Well, at least for my setup they are anyway. These guys are a, a bit easier to fight, so, um... As you can see, like, all of my t parties basically leveled at this point, so... Ah, actually, we could do two quests here. I just realized, isn't that the nests from before? Preemptive of attack! Okay, good. We're just gonna kick the shit out of it then. Hey, there you go. Right, so... Now, there was a... I'm sure there was a nest or something around here. Broken axe. Okay, yeah, that's not bad. I think it might be on the second floor, actually. Ah. 
That is interesting. Oh, it could be over here, actually. Oh, did I forget to mark it down properly? Okay, I'm going to check where the exact location of this thing is because I don't want to end up walking around forever trying to find it, so I'll be up back. Okay, I'm actually completely incorrect. Um, I misunderstood the information I was given. Um, so, like, uh, what we need to do is actually go over here. Let's hit this thing with a stunner. Uh, let's press vault on it. You don't want to go too crazy with the attacks here. We didn't even need to in the end. All right, cool. Right, so um, Turns out the guy's over here. I think. Oh no. Maybe I'm incorrect. He's inside one of these doors anyway. Oh shit, I accidentally skipped through that. Fuck. Well anyway, this is the guy, so you open the door and continue through. Looking up you see a monster's large horns blocking a path before you. Can only be the monster that Clyton encounters once you drop the pearl. Alright, so we're, we're going to fight this dude. It's a werewolf! Okay, so... Um, hit this guy with a stunner. We're going to try and save what's legs. Um, I don't think this guy's immune to flame. I'm going to immunize everyone as well. Oh, we just literally one-shot the thing. That is a gigantic meme. Okay. Oh, you do find a pit where the monster stood leading to the floor below. That's the boy seek is in the pit the other end of the pit. Take his way, wah. To get another pit, you encounter a second horned beast. Perhaps it is true the monster client dropped the pearl. Search, you have to wait until the monster before he is slain. Okay. Alright. Yeah, that seems a bit more like it. That seems like something that would actually cause you problems. I'm gonna trickery this guy. I'm gonna hit him with a flame. And I'm also gonna be nice. It's charging! Okay, skills, uh, back guard. <laughs> Try and stun it. Um, gonna quicken everyone. See if Thunder does more damage. Um, I'm just gonna ask you to defend, I guess. Oh, he stunned it. Lol, nice. It is stunned, so we just 
wait on this fucker. Alright. Uh, yeah, I think we two shot this dude. Uh, defense. That is. Oh my days! Tarkus just got rocks. Okay, if he's struggling versus this guy, everyone's struggling versus this guy. It's gonna be an issue. Okay, well, a bunch of people leveled. He wants to slowly staggers to the ground, small stone tools in its mouth. You can see it's a small shining pearl. This could just be the treasure your client lost. Try to take the pearl back to town. Hellball has been killed. Okay, so. Um. Definitely healing Tarkus. Okay, uh. Huh. Yeah, we actually might need to level up our healing a little bit now because I think it's not sufficient. Um, we will probably put one more point into immunize, uh, and then we'll probably do do it like that. I think uh, I'm just gonna grind this bit a little bit so that um, thunder and that. Hexody to go, so Okay, so that that leveled everyone. Uh we could actually go now. We don't don't need to push this too far. Um Jane, 2000. Welcome back, kids. Good job in finding that pearl. The client was happy to have it back. I can't believe a monster ate it, though. Heard some animals swallow stains for digestion, but I didn't know this was true. Guess that monster needed to do the same thing, huh? At least he found it. For first sake, I think I'll leave out the details of how you got it back. Okay. Yeah, I'm not doing these quests. That's stupid. Um. Alright. Making a little bit of money back. Not a lot of money, mind you, but. Let's go put a little bit of dent in the um the the in cost, I guess. And that's gonna be it for this episode. Actually, no, it's not, because what I'm actually gonna do is actually uh customize. Yes. Alright, so shields need to be level 7, so we've now got on guard. Um, I think we actually, um, I think we finally level up Crush. That's what we do. Um, to be honest, I think ambush might actually be a better thing to do. Yeah, that might be good because getting preemptively attacked sucks balls. So we we want to make sure the seems are nice and leveled. Um, with Meb, uh, yeah, we're definitely putting TP regen up to level three. Um, like, I'm not sure if it's like an incredible thing to put stuff in, but like, I, I feel at least that for now would be good because it's like, you know, um, it will um, allow me to continuously keep casting spells. Um, we definitely need to make sure that we up our um, group attack spells at some point. Uh, Luna, yeah, I, we're gonna um, we're gonna put immune nice up to level five. Um, and then after that, we're definitely going to have to concentrate on actually um, uh, maybe getting Salve up to level 3. 
Like, we need our healing to be better, is what I'm saying. Um, yeah, I, I think that's worth it. Anyway, um, I'm now going to go save the game. So thank you very much for joining me, guys, and I'll catch you guys soon. Goodbye.